Captain Marvel's MCU future gets promising update. Marvel Studios reportedly still has plans for Carol Danvers slash Captain Marvel in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Despite the superhero's latest film, The Marvels, underperforming at the global box office. While a third Captain Marvel movie is not expected to enter development anytime soon, trusted insider Alex Perez of the Cosmic Circus has reported that Brie Larson's Captain Marvel will still play an important part in the multiverse saga. I have heard Carol's role in the MCU as of now is to focus on two things. The first is to decipher the true origin of the quantum bands from the Marvels, with Carol presenting her bangle to Wong and Banner. While Kamala does the same, albeit with a couple of new friends on the way, Perez shared. The second thing is to find a way to bring Monica back to the MCU, but given what we know about incursions, they might find their way back to each other sooner than they think. Trusted insider Alex Perez reveals how Marvel Studios plans to use Benedict Cumberbatch's Doctor Strange in future MCU movies. The Marvels failed to click with audiences. Despite being part of the commercially successful MCU, the Marvels was unable to connect with audiences around the world, leading to a disappointing box office haul. The movie, which served as a sequel to 2019's Captain Marvel, as well as Disney Plus series WandaVision and Ms. Marvel, grossed only $205.8 million worldwide, making it the lowest-earning MCU title to date. The film was also poorly received by critics, with a 62% approval score on the review aggregate website Rotten Tomatoes. However, MCU fans were more favorable of the Marvels with the sequel managing to snag an 83% audience score on the site. Tayona Paris, who portrays Monica Rambeau in WandaVision and the Marvels, recently addressed the movie's poor box office performance, believing that the MCU entry would have fared better if audiences had been more open-minded. I think there was a lot of talk, and people hadn't seen it. So that's frustrating when people comment on things they haven't actually experienced, she said. There's a lot of people who put a lot of their time, spirit, and talent into bringing this forward. I would hope that people would give it a fair shot by just seeing it or trying it. Eyes of Wakanda EP confirms the animated series' place in the MCU multiverse. Marvel Studios executive Brad Winderbaum opens up about where the Black Panther animated series, Eyes of Wakanda, takes place in the multiverse. Ms. Marvel's MCU future is also looking promising. Although a second season of Ms. Marvel is not yet in the works at Marvel Studios, Iman Vellani recently revealed that she had been assured that Kamala Khan slash Ms. Marvel will be back in a future MCU project, so that feels good, but there was no more assurance than that, she added with a laugh. They give me breadcrumbs, and I try and make a meal out of it. The Marvels ended with Vellani's Ms. Marvel attempting to recruit Kate Bishop Haley Steinfeld into her superhero team, which is rumored to be the Young Avengers. Captain Marvel and the Marvels are available to stream on Disney. Carol Danvers gets her powers entangled with those of Kamala Khan and Monica Rambeau, forcing them to work together to save the universe.